Part 3 Chapter 34 Betty's Real Name No! Betty and I both uttered startled cries. Our uncle is in the cave, Betty said. Who are you? He tugged off his baseball cap and smoothed back his rust-colored hair. He's not your uncle. I am. But, but, I sputtered. He's a book thief known as The Collector, the man said. I thought it was my friend. He has come to my house many times. I thought I could trust him. I told him too many of my secrets, but he turned out to be a thief. But we found him locked in the shed, Betty said. He told us that the bookworm arrived and locked him in the shed. Then the bookworm tied me up in the attic. It took me all this time to escape. He looked from Betty to me. I was so worried about you two. Betty and I exchanged glances. How do we know we can believe you? Betty asked. Everyone tells us their window, I added. I just captured the bookworm and his daughter, he replied. I found them following the trail in the forest. I took them back to the house and tied them up. Then I was frantic to find you. I've been searching. He stopped when a shout rang out through the trees. I spun around and saw the blonde-haired window running from the cave. He had a canvas bag swinging from one hand. Yes, that's the collector, the red-haired man said. Now I need to capture him, too. He stood behind a wide tree trunk. Don't let him know I'm here. Running hard, the other window spotted us and waved. The bag swung wildly at his side. I turned to Betty. What shall we do? Who can we believe? Before she could answer, the blonde window caught up to us. Got it, he said, raising the bag. Let's get away from here. Not so fast, the new window cried, leaping out from behind the tree. He reached out both hands. I'll take the book now, Collector. Collector? He pulled back and swung the bag behind him. I don't know who you mean, and I don't know who you are. I'm the kid's Uncle Window. You can't keep that up, Collector. You can't fool these kids any longer, and I won't let you get away with my book. I'm their uncle. They know me. They know I'm the Uncle Window. I studied the man holding the book bag, the man with the blonde hair. Then I turned my gaze on the one with red hair falling under his baseball cap. Which one? Which one? Suddenly, I knew what to do. I took a step forward. Only one of you is telling the truth, I said. But I know how to tell the real window. Both men stared at me. Tell us Betty's real name, I said.